Saturday night at BG was Olympic night. Falcons honoring their Olympic heroes from 1980, Mark Wells, Ken Morrow. They had bobbleheads for fans, but the Olympic connections with these two teams, Minnesota State and Bowling Green, and actually the Olympic connections for Northwest Ohio go even further. When the Falcons faced off against the Mavericks last weekend, MSU was without their head coach, as Mike Hastings is in China helping coach Team USA for the 2022 Olympic Games. I was fortunate. I've known David Quinn for a while, who's the head coach uh, of Team USA, and uh, I've had some opportunities to be involved with Team USA at different levels, whether it was in the USHL, uh, whether it's been at the World Juniors, and so David and I have had a long history together. And for me, it's it's when he when he made the call. Uh, I couldn't say yes fast enough uh, because to have an opportunity, as always, with USA Hockey to represent your country and now with the pinnacle in the Olympics, I'm honored. I look forward to it and want to do everything we can to help us come back and try and win gold. He's an amazing coach. He's, uh, you know, he really cares about all his players and uh, he really pushes us every single day to get better. Um, and he doesn't, he doesn't do it for himself. Uh, you know, he's pushing us to get us to the next level and I think that's what it really matters. And um, you know, he, he treats us like this is our family. Um, and to see him get the opportunity, as well as Nathan, uh, to go and represent the USA uh, at the Olympics is, is unbelievable and more than well deserved for those guys. They're good people. Mike Hastings is as good a coach as there is in college hockey, and he's a really good person, does a great job with his program. And, and, and Nathan Smith is a great player for them. So for those two people to be recognized and, and get and accomplish being Olympians in college is, is, is really a good thing, not only for them, but for our league, because they, they certainly deserve it. And so uh, we'll celebrate that and, and uh, wish them the best. Joining Hastings in Beijing is another familiar name for hockey fans in Northwest Ohio, former walleye goaltender Pat Nagel. He's a guy that's got some rubber on the road, so to say. He's, he's been successful at every level he's been at. Um, and we're going to try and rely upon his experience um, and have him be a guy that's setting our culture, have him be a guy that's setting the examples uh, when things aren't going well. Uh, so we're excited about him, him being a part of our team and we'll be leaning on him throughout the Olympics. Team USA's first contest of the 2022 Olympic Games is set for Thursday against China. Reporting for Ice Check, Claire Dow, BCSN.